Well, they're the super dads swapping footballs for tiaras. In a world of glitzy gowns and stage mums, there's a new trend emerging on the pageant scene. Yeah, from taming tantrums to coordinating dance routines, these stage dads are their daughter's biggest cheerleaders. Move over stage mums, meet the dads behind the divas. Happy. Helping their little girls win titles and tiaras. My wife and I are always joking that if you need to fix a flat tire, you go to her. If you need to win Miss Universe, you come to me. From teaching talent routines. Here, look, airplane with dada, airplane. Come on. To designing costumes. We come up with ideas, color schemes. Sometimes we clash. Sometimes we don't. Um, it just depends on what we're going for. It's not always easy being a man in a girly world. I got teased a little bit, because um, when I first started doing this several years back, there weren't a lot of dads involved. Through the years, more and more fathers have been coming around. But to these doting dads supporting their mini beauty queens, beats a sports game any day. Right now she's a little girl and she's gonna, I'm going to be walking her down the aisle sooner or later, and I'm not going to be able to get those memories back. So I, I always will have time for football later on in life. Well, joining us now from Melbourne is pageant dad, Ben Ramos, and his daughter, his beauty queen daughter, Amelia. Good morning and welcome to the morning show, you guys. Hi, how are you? Good. Hi. Uh, ben, most people used to stage mums. This is kind of a new concept. Why did you decide to get involved in the first place? Well, I saw how much fun she was having at the Follow Your Dreams pageants, and so I was more than happy to help her out with her training and with her props and even setting up her YouTube videos. Okay, so what is it that you actually do with Amelia? Well, uh, we, do, we do a lot of training at home. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, if uh, she needs any props built, I'll do that for her. And yeah. um, she likes to, you know, pop up her progress on her Twitter account and, and on her YouTube channel. Hey, OK. Amelia, what, what do you like the most about having Dad around at your beauty pageants? I like him watching me win crowns and trophies. Oh, wow. of course you do. Ben, stage dads are becoming more and more common over in the US. We just saw that clip there from all the shows. What about here in Australia? Are you still quite the novelty? Oh, well, no, I see a lot of uh, dads at the pageants um, supporting their kids and, and that's really good to see and you know, I really hope that that continues in the future. Okay. Now, Amelia, you won the Beauty Queen title at the Universal Pageant in Sydney recently, so congratulations with that. That's great news. D did Dad help you out with all that stuff? Yes. <laughs> what did he help you with? He, um, we practice at home a lot. Practice. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Amelia, what's the favourite bit? What's the bit you like doing most in the pageants? Crowning. What? Crowning. Crowning, Crowning. she said. What, what does, you mean actually getting the crown? Getting the tiara? Yeah. yeah, that would be my favourite <laughs> bit too. But what about when you have to do you, do you sing, do you dance? What is it that you actually do up on stage? Um, uh, Dad, what is she? What, uh, yeah, she, yeah. Uh, she, um, she does her, she's got her set routines, that she's got her beauty routines and her talent. She's, um, she's done some flamenco dancing on stage and she's um, dressed up as a, as a little ice cream vendor. Mm -hmm. uh, and pushed a cart around the stage that I built for her a while ago. Yeah. And, um, yeah, she just really enjoys it on stage and, you know, it really shows that, you know, she's enjoying herself and that's why we, you know, we keep doing it. OK. Uh, ben, we can't get away from this. There's been a lot of controversy surrounding pushy parents in pageants. I'm sure you've seen more of the shows from America than we have. So, so what do you say about that? You can see the culture building certainly in America and, and the parents at the side of the stage getting, you know, very pushy. Yeah, well, I think what people see on, on these reality TV shows is, is nothing like what happens in real life. And from all of the Australian pageants that I've been to, and even at the Universal Royalty Texas-based pageant, you know, all of the kids are having a great time and it really shows. And I think that's the main point that everybody has to realise. Mm. OK. How, long, how much longer will Amelia continue to, to take part in pageants for, Ben? Well, really, as long as, you know, she's enjoying herself. And so, so far she is. She, you know, she loves it and she really looks forward to the next one and, you know, really enjoys the, the practice at home together. And we always, you know, have fun while we practice and play games and things mm. like that. And so it's really up to her. OK. Amelia, you're going to keep doing this for a long, long time? Mm. You like the pageants? 
Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Likes of pageants much more than being on live television in the morning. <laughs> and, and Amelia, nice to talk to you both. Thank you very much for joining us. Thank you. Anytime. Okay. See you, Amelia. Bye. Bye. See ya. Bye.